We have these lights in the kitchen and they're nice, but uh, they kill LED bulbs because this part here really traps the heat inside because there's no way for the air to escape on top. So I'm going to drill a hole to try to fix that. My plan has been to use a small diamond drill like this to drill maybe four holes around the perimeter. And I tested that by drilling a hole in a wine bottle and it took a long time. So now I'm thinking maybe drill just one hole towards the back side where it's least visible. So these drills really need to have flowing water on them. And if I were to just try to drill a hole like this without a guide, it just slides all over the place. So I made this guide and that goes on here like this and that will help me get the hole started without skipping around. I'm starting to break through in a few places. So uh, that took about four minutes to get through. The problem with drilling glass is there's really no such thing as drilling glass. It's more of a, a braiding all the way through it, like sanding. So here's the modified light and from the back, the hole doesn't look great, but uh, not noticeable from the rest of the kitchen. Now to check the temperature rise, I put a 60 watt bulb in each of those lights. And let's measure the temperature. 46 degrees. And the one I haven't modified, 56 degrees. With ambient at 20 degrees, the modified one at 46 degrees and unmodified at 56 degrees, we have a 26 degree rise versus 36 degree rise or 0.72 times as much, or a 28% reduction in temperature rise. And that's measuring on the outside of the glass. I'm hoping that inside it's even more, but that's much harder to measure. And now I just gotta do the rest of the lights in this kitchen.